Okay, humans, we're here and we're bloody excited. We have the Maddington Toyota Speedway Grand Final at the Perth Motorplex. Back with the CTM Recruitment Racing Late Model Team for another epic night of racing. Luke, mate, you got me excited there. Epic battle number 15 there, mate. Yeah, mate, we had a good run. Um, yeah. Kenny's good race with people like Kenny because he's, uh, you know, keeps us straight and, and uh, sort of, you know, got to be careful. You know, some guys are still learning out here and just, we're just trying to get that car straight. So, uh, so we get forward, move a few spots forward and get going for the feature. Ken, mate, great little battle there against Luke. Tell us about it. Uh, yeah, it was good. I could see him there for probably four or five laps at least. Um, yeah. I was just trying to leave him a line and I was sort of battling with the guy in front of me as well. And I managed to make a hole on the last lap and I think he followed me through. Yeah. Um, but no, it's good racing with guys like Luke because you know he'll leave you a line and you can race with each other. of a moment there together did you just touch did you yeah, or? drove off yeah. the side you use your me as a sort of a backstop bouncing off me but you know, sometimes shit happens but you know yeah, yeah. shit's part of the game and what we can do is move forward Where's your like line that you follow? Where's your favourite part of the track that you follow? Because uh, Luke was like hugging the inside yeah. line quite a bit. What, what about yourself? But where do you find it's quickest? Um, I was moving around a fair bit then, trying to find the quickest line. But yeah. probably should have moved down a little bit where Luke was into the dirt a bit more. But yeah, I don't know. I think if you can search around and find something, then sometimes it'll help. Okay, heat one was done and dusted there for Luke. Got completely lost as I always do. <laughs> so I'm not sure what position he came, but he had a great battle there with um with 15. So let's go have a chat to uh, Racer in number 15 and see how his little battle went with Luke there. What was your starting position, mate? Uh, what did I start out of then? I think uh, I was supposed to start out at eight, but the car in front wasn't out there, so I started at six. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And then what did you finish in in the end? I reckon fifth, mate. Yep. Yeah. So not too bad. Yeah. You just want to be consistent and start towards the front of the feature. Did you just start out? You started start out in the, the rear. Back. Yeah. yeah. Start off the back, so we moved forward four spots. So. I oh, mid. Yeah. If we can get another good points run in the first heat, no, in the second heat, you're starting off the front. So. Yep. Fingers crossed, we should be able to get moving. If we can run top three, we should get a good starting position in the feature. Here we 
we go, Luke, second heat. Not gonna lie, I got lost again. <laughs> so I, mate, I was out there. But it was a bit of a lonely heat that was. Yeah, it was, it? mate. Yeah, yeah, that was. Um, look, you know, I've yeah probably you know made a couple of. I did make a couple of errors and sort of got a bit flustered and sort of got to learn, sort of still learning it myself and yeah, just yeah made a couple of errors and yeah, it's all right. It's all it takes, mate. As soon as you take a couple of errors, it takes a few laps to get back into it. Once you get back going, it's sort of a bit difficult to. Yep. catch the guys because they're usually checked out but yeah 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 so what errors oh, i just uh, got in a bit hot coming into turn one and sort of turned into a push and when the cars are so closely bunched like that you'll find that everybody will sort of swamp you and get overtaken and then, yeah was that the first yeah, lap the first couple of laps yeah, yeah. So as soon yeah. as that happens it's, it's difficult to get your momentum back and, and and get your composure back sometimes and sort of i lost my head a little bit and once you lose your head and lose your concentration on these things you can't afford to sort of you know, it takes a few laps to get your head back, and once yeah. you do get your head back, well, you know, usually by then it's too late. Hey Rod, mate, thanks for having a chat. No worries, mate. Mate, I didn't end up following you for the first heat. How'd you go? Uh, struggled a little bit tonight. I think we finished sixth or seventh, but um, it's 30 lap final, so yep. hopefully we can move forward. Yep, and your first heat, mate, what did you start out? What position were you we in? Or we what? started out of six, and uh, I think we either held, held six position or dropped back one, but. Um, yeah, just like I say, we've struggled on the uh, slick track, so um, yep. yeah, it's a bit of a concern for us. <laughs> <laughs> and the second, your second heat, mate, or heat three? Yeah, we I started see. a fair way back. Um, I think a tenth or eleventh or something like that, and I yep. moved up a few spots, probably seventh again, I think, maybe. Yep. And uh, Luke, mate, was on your tail. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, yeah. Luke, Luke and I have some good battles uh, over the last uh, over the season. So um, yeah, no, he's a good clean racer, and um, yeah, it's good to have some side by side racing. And you were catching 21, I believe, there, if you're, yeah, you're chasing him for yeah, a while. Yeah, Rod were having a good little bit of a run there for a bit, so yep. we will just sort of catching up together, and sort of there was me, right and the Veronica, we were sort of all battling away there, but, yep. um, yeah, look, we can just move forward in the feature. We're starting out of 10, which is, you know, if you can start 10 and forward, you've sort of got yourself half a shot to sort of get going for the night and stay away from the many carnage, hopefully. <laughs> And the car itself, mate, how did the car perform? Yeah, the car's pretty good, mate. Yep. I can't fault the car. Yep. You know, the car's pretty much, yeah. And my dad does an awesome job prepping the car. Yep. Um, all the credit goes to him and, you know, Brent from racing helps me and, you know, Craig and 
you know, all my sponsors, without all my sponsors, CTM, Green Old Farms, Don Blocking, Auto Electrics, um, you know, uh, Northside, Dino's, Haulage, you know, without any of these guys, you know, we wouldn't be able to go racing and enjoy it and have a bit of fun. Ken, that was your third heat, or well, second heat, but heat three, how'd you go? Uh, ran third, so it wasn't too bad. Started out of, um, probably started out of five. Yep. So, move forward a couple. Um, yeah, move on to the feature. I think I'm out of seven for the feature, so. Seventh in the feature? Yep, 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 for 30 laps, so we'll see how we go. Yep. And the car itself, mate, what are, you, are you doing any tweaks or anything, or are you happy with the car? Uh, we've just been, what we call, tightening it up all night, so just, um, making it a little less sideways basically yep. um, as the track blows away so yeah we'll, we'll do a little bit more on it now and hopefully it'll come to us yep, yep. nice and yourself your own performance mate how do you reckon you went <laughs> oh, not too bad so so many good guys here to race with so yeah yeah if you can finish in the front half i reckon you're doing pretty well moving forward that's the main thing yeah eh? yep. that's it yeah yep. nice mate looking forward to the feature no worries mate. and the feature itself mate you're starting off next to luke i believe in Ninth was it? Ninth place? Yeah, ninth yep. place, yeah. Ninth Luke on the outside, but um, hopefully both of us can move forward and not backwards. <laughs> um, so how, how are you finding the track itself? Um, what, where's the fastest line you, you think in the track? Uh, look, tonight it's it's pretty slick and I don't like slick tracks. I like when the tracks have got a bit of dirt on them and the car seems to go better. And um, But yeah, I'm guessing there's going to be some lines on the bottom, maybe mid up top but it's a matter of getting the um the throttle co control under control and you know, try and get it to the ground and move forward yep and how do you how are you finding the car mate you find it's yeah no, the car, good? yeah no so we put a new motor in for tonight so um yeah, it seems to be going all right but i can't use the power so um <laughs> yeah it's frustrating yep no worries mate thanks for the chat and look forward to seeing you in the feature no worries thank you Let's go! Late model racing, feature race.
got going there, good to the wall, and yeah, and unfortunately we got met tangled up with a lap car, um, and sort of he came. Look, he's a lap car, you know what I mean. Trying to get underneath him, and we had a good night in the end. We 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 worked forward and got up to six, and yep. we sort of I think we had a good car to keep maybe get in the top five and. You um, did, mate. You were catching that, yeah, next, that next group yeah, as well. Yeah. Just, and just on that, actually, because you come in, I thought you had car trouble. You came in and I stopped. came in to want to tell them that he was a lap car. Like, oh, okay. That's the reason. I came yeah. in to stop and ask him to tell him that he was a lap car. That, you know, I didn't... He technically needs to move out of the way. It is, it's easier said than done. So I know there's a lot going on out there. Greg wouldn't have mean to. I didn't mean to hit him.
epic feature race. A yeah, lot of battles there. Yeah, it was a lot of battling. The track yep. was fast because they ripped it just before we went out. Yep. Um, do they usually do that? Sorry, man. Nah, because nah. it started to take rubber, they were worried about it killing tyres. So yep. they tilled the bottom and the top, but then that makes it ultra fast. Um, so we ended up running around the top. We're up to fourth and uh, we got to lap traffic and the guy under me unfortunately stayed there and I was sort of pinned to the top and, and caught a lap car and he got me so we ended up fifth but yep. it's a good race. Yeah, yep. nice. And well, you had a bit of battle there with Luke there as well, and right next door here, number yeah, 50. Yeah, Luke was a bit unfortunate there to get caught up with a lap car. Yep. Um, sometimes that can be a bit like a mobile roadblock. <laughs> uh, and he just caught the bad end of it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, overall, good feature. Yep. Good fun. Abby, thanks for having a chat. Awesome feature race there. I see you had a couple of battles with Luke. Uh, How yeah. was it? Uh, yeah, it was good. We ran a couple laps together and yep. we did a couple slide jogs and was <laughs> lucky enough to break and miss him and hopefully duck, uh, a couple times duck back underneath and just kept swapping spots a couple times, I guess. And yeah, yeah so we'll just move on. We had a good night. We look forward to Toowoomba in a couple of weeks. Go to Queensland for Aussie title. Feel confident now and yeah, quite happy. Yep, and that'll be the end of the season, mate. That's that it, last, mate. Last yeah, race. that's yeah. the last one for the season, and then we'll start up again in Allenbrook in October. Oh, nice. During the winter, we'll have Rob, the uh, CTM owner and sort of the team owner. Yep. He will be running winter and run young rider, so um, we'll have a bit of a winter sort of series for those guys. Yep. I'll sit back and have a bit of a watch and help them and... Nice. Yeah, get have a bit of relax for a while. Yeah, nice, mate. And uh, championship, mate, where would you end up? I think it was about seventh or eighth or something in the championship in the end. So look, we missed a couple of rounds. We just stayed consistent all year. Yeah. You know, we just can't seem to get over this voodoo of eighth and seventh. It's just good. Yeah. But look, it's a good spot to be if you can be in that top <laughs> ten. Like, I'm exhausted, mate. Like, yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's 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 one of those things. But yeah, look, happy night. Cars semi straight. Cars in one piece. You know, we go to Toowoomba in a couple of weeks and, and, and have a good night. And what'd you come? Do you know what you come in the end of the championship, mate? Fifth, I reckon. Oh yeah. yeah. Nice. Happy with that? Yeah, it's a good year. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely with the calibre of the guys that are out here now. Yeah, happy with that. What's the highlight of your year, mate, going off that? Uh, my home track's Allenbrook and I ran well there. I ran third there at the start of the season. Yep. I always love running there and um, probably that that was ultra fun, that feature. Yep. Yeah, that feature, yeah. yeah it was good. meant, yep. Yeah. And uh, any plans for the off-season, mate, with the car or keep it as is and come um, out for next next. Well, this isn't mine, this is Warren's. Okay. Because I sold both mine. But um, hopefully, yeah, we'll bring another car in from the States and, and get ready for next year. Oh, you filling in, are you, as a driver? Or? Uh, Warren was kind enough to lend it to me to finish the season off. Oh, nice. So, yeah, yeah. good. Yep, and I, uh, all right, we're going off that, mate. Who do you have to thank for the season? Um, just all my sponsors, Avon Valley Toyota, probably the main one. Um, yep. They support me through thick and thin. Um, MHR, uh, Oldfield Racing, uh, yeah, the list is long. Um, yeah, just thanks to them all. I know you got one round left, mate. Unfortunately, I won't be able to come over nah, to, to film me. I would love to if it was yep. a full time job. So hit that like and That's subscribe right, button. Mate, he's liking, like, he does an awesome <laughs> job, this fella, mate. So everyone get behind him and, thanks, mate. you know, and, and look, yeah. yeah, all the speedway people, all sorts of motorsport all over the world. Get behind this guy. He's, you know, does an awesome job. Hell of a bloke. Thanks, know, mate. Does an awesome job. And, and who do you have to thank, mate, for the season? Oh, I know look, you had one left, but who do you have to thank for the season? And oh, look, there's a few team. people. Rob Wells from Murray Wiles from CTM Recruitment, yeah. you know. Um, you know, we formed this team. Rob's been running for years and sort of we came together just by luck and stuff like that and we've sort of, yeah, built this team up to what it is now. And also I'd race Wells, all of putting the stickers on the car for me. Um, yeah. yeah, and just... Uh, I'm not just saying this, mate, but... Oh, I love the yellow and black, mate. Yeah. It's one of the best looking cars. Yeah, yeah. it is. It's yeah. a nice looking piece. Not putting the knee pads on, mate. Nah, boy. you're right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it is. It does yeah. stand out. Yeah. yeah. And like uh, Darren yeah. Smith, Green Old Farms, and Brad Ward there from uh, Don Blocking Auto Electrics, Dino's Haulage, um, Racing, Craig and Brent. Yep. All these guys are, you know, they help me and. We're slowly getting back together and get forward and, 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 and we'll work the work our magic and yep. yeah, look forward to another good solid year here next year. Yep, and uh, going off that, what's your plans for next year, mate? Are you gonna keep the car how it is? Are you gonna change anything or no, we'll just fully rebuild it over the over the winter. Yeah. Rebuild the engine, um, go through it all and, and 
We might do a little bit of a design change. I think I've been looking at a few, so I will change my car up a little bit just with a bit of design. And always like to change them every year and yep. keep the design fresh. And, oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, so it'll be similar, but I've got a few ideas and just mix it up as we go. Yeah, freshen up the block, you said, as yeah, well. Yeah, mate, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's we'll, the old man's job, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, that's the old man's job, mate. Yeah. So after Toowoomba, <laughs> we'll strip that down and yep. get new pistons and, and bits and pieces for it. Yeah. What just, was the block again, mate? What are you, what are you running? It's a 421. Yeah, yeah, open motor Chevy. So, um, racing engine from the States, is it? Or? Yeah, it is. From yeah. Jamie Moore from the States. Yeah. Uh, he builds, my dad builds them, but he sends over the parts and stuff. So, yeah, um, yeah, it's a good solid motor and good package and good car. Yeah. No worries, mate. Thanks again and good luck over in Queensland, isn't it? Thank, yeah. Yeah, good yeah. luck over there, mate. Thanks for putting it on. Like I said, mate, you, you're on fire there. <laughs> Thanks, Jimmy. Yeah, much appreciate everything you've done, mate. Yeah. yeah. yeah no like I said, everyone, get behind this bike, like and follow, subscribe. Comment. Hit him up, comment, whatever. <laughs>